Hey guys, today I will be answering some of your questions, honestly, with no cuts, no editing, nothing, only truth. Like questions like how much money do you make? Do you have a girlfriend? Do you have a life? What does your grandparents think about your videos? Why did you even start YouTube? Why are you not uploading? Are you even alive? Questions like this. And I promise from my bottom of my heart, I will tell you the truth. I promise. First, do you have a girlfriend? See guys, I never had a girlfriend. And I started going on Omi TV because I never had a girlfriend. But now I became really good at talking to girls. Everybody thinks I will have a girlfriend. But when I'm talking to girls in real life, I'm actually getting shy. So I'm having split personality, okay? You're not understanding my problem. I'm suffering from success. How much time do you spend on creating these videos? You must be using a premier bro. I spend one month every day, eight hours, four hours recording, four hours editing. But now I have a team. Thanks to my team, cute team. Uh, but eight hours every single day for two years, like Omi TV, Omegle. Then the best thing about me going online is that because I, I edit my own videos, for two to three years, I can see, okay, if I made, if I said a girl, Hey, you're kind of cute. She kind of skipped, right? But I would say like, your eyes are cute, but your nose is very, very cute. Then she would laugh. So I would analyze myself, analyze myself and understand what girls really like. And what girls really like is basically being unpredictable. That means you're funny, but there are so many other things. Maybe I'll make a separate video on how to get a girlfriend from a guy who never had a girlfriend. You're taking so long to upload the videos. See, when I was 15, when I was 19, when I was, now I'm 22, 18, 15, 18, 22. These are like some of my slow years, meaning that figuring myself out. Like when I was 15, I was like at a low point. You know, I, I had some bad habits and I wanted to, you know, do something. And that's when, you know, I slow things down and I take inspiration. Okay. What should I do? And I decided to become a football player. And then I got my leg, uh, a disease in my legs called as Osgood Sclater disease, which means it's not an injury. It's a disease. That means you cannot recover from it. It'll keep coming back every time you play too much. And then after I getting injured, I, again, uh, went into that slow phase, getting inspiration. Then I decided to become a YouTuber. Now, uh, I've, I'm again, you know, because I have this team, I'm going again in this inspiration phase, like, okay, what do I want to do? And then I, I recognize guys, this is what I want to do. Okay. I want to make travel vlogs. I said it now. Why? So basically I will meet girls on Omi TV. I'll be like, please, can I, please, can I come to you? And then I will book a flight ticket, knock on their door. And then they will show me the place. Like if it's Nepal, by the way, I already got a Nepal girlfriend, already got a Bengali girlfriend, already got a Telugu girlfriend. These are 2023. And I want like 10 girlfriends in 10 different areas, but not girlfriends like, you know, like girlfriend, girlfriend, like kind of like, uh, playing along girlfriend, you know, like we both flirt with each other, stuff like that. But it's going to be real, you know, it's not fake. I don't make fake videos guys. Okay. Why you started YouTube? Uh, I was lonely. So I thought, you know, the reason why I was lonely because the leg disease that I got, it's an injury and a disease too. Who are you? So I'm Abhi Honey B and the reason, okay. Somebody should have asked why, why, why did I name Abhi Honeybee? Then I would have given this answer, but I will give this answer. I named myself Honeybee because, uh, every time a male honeybee has sex with female honeybee queen, the male honeybee falls off and dies. That's what I want my audience to be. I want my audience to watch my videos and, uh, understand. Like, okay, this is how you flirt. This is how you, uh, talk to a girl. This is how you be kind, you know, actually being girly 
is is not like a bad thing it's like you know you're actually being kind and you're listening to girl and these are some of the themes in my videos like if you watched my korean or my jack sparrow i'm a little bit like uh, almost like a gay you, you know like a gay person and that's because i'm not gay but being kind is the first thing you know and second thing is having goals like n- not the relationship itself but having something i uh, will get into this later you know i want to make a full video on this how to get a girlfriend from a guy who never had a girlfriend uh yeah so and when when the male honeybee falls off and dies i want you to guys unsubscribe to me because my content is not interesting anymore because you guys have a girlfriend right i hope so that's what the theme of the channel is i hope you i i made it up after i put the name uh how many wives do you have soon i will have and you completed your study okay my study i did it till 12th grade uh i studied in a privileged school and in my school everybody spoke english very well and i was kind of like insecure because i came from a uh you know kind of like not so english speaking schools so i would uh, always make fun of myself like but i ended up liking make fun making fun of myself that uh it became my identity that i want to make people laugh that's why people kind of get confused when they look at me like i have like kind of like cute cute looks like but why am i acting so girly and uh, so feminine like i have to show attitude and this that but i make fun of myself because uh, you know i want to make other people laugh and after school i went to this football academy search my name abhinav reddy padam that's my full name a i f f all india football federation that is like a uh, b c i i c c cricket world cup right that's this is a i f f football federation and you can see abhinav reddy padam december that's my birthday coming up but i was born in telangana okay when i was young telangana did not exist no offense uh, andhra pradesh was only one state then they split up so in my birth certificate it showed andhra pradesh that's why they kept it uh, and then india which should be updated you know i will update it don't put a case india indian football association kfa sound this is the team now minutes played zero lifetime Z- zero goals zero yellow card zero permanent 12 months i'm a professional amateur player by the way yeah so this is my season by the way thanks for asking when did you come back to life with without- <laughs> and like i said i was you know taking inspiration inspiration now what life meaning okay Uh, this is a very deep question i'll answer it as fast as i can <sighs> for me it's making other people happy i'm not the best at it but i'm trying my best have you ever dated a magical person in real life you said you will tell the truth so i haven't dated yet but i'm willing to date so right now believe me or not i have a bengali girlfriend i have a nepali girlfriend i have a telugu girlfriend and first i will go out with bengali girlfriend hopefully jayashri she's cute she's cute and uh, telugu girlfriend and nepali girlfriend uh, they said they're okay with it but i'm training them you know i'm training them to like uh, be like uh, not you know some people will read the comments and they will feel sad like i don't want any girls to be sad because of my you know konti chestal telugu debut okay koi moi voice was, was was your favorite actress my favorite actress is trisha when i watched uh, this telugu movie no vastana ante nenu vaddantana it is uh, one of my favorite telugu movies 
I really liked her because she played uh, amazing roles where she was cute, funny, and she was also like very womanly type. And when Siddharth was working hard, she would like give him water and everything. I wish I get a girl like that. How you got this idea to do these funny things and what you do except Omegle? So first, how I get these ideas? I only think about YouTube. That's the truth. So even when I'm taking a shower, I think about YouTube. And this ideas is basically like, uh, I have no limits. Basically, for example, when I first did this Jack Sparrow, right? There was this thing like, uh, there was this thing like, oh, bro, you're acting gay, you know, you're, you're gay, this, that. People will say that, but I kept going, you know, so the, to get this funny ideas, bro, you, you need to think like a kid and a kid doesn't think about the consequences, you know, and don't think about the consequences. If you're going to be creative, just do it. Like that's why most of my videos are kind of like disappointing sometimes but they're sometimes very good but but that's okay what do you do except i play football again i'm not totally injured the disease will only come back if i do if i play heavily it's complicated but uh i'm happy you know what do you why do your videos come so late That's a good question. What do you want to become in life? I want to help people. You know, I want to make uh, people feel less lonely. Hopefully my content does that. Maybe they're getting turned on by my content, but I want them to like, uh, you know, one of my favorite videos are like uh, Indian, uh, Korean girl fell in love with Indian, Nepali girl, the long conversations where people are like, calling me gentleman and everything, you know, I, I really like that because there is this huge like misconception going in, uh, in the movie industries, especially where, uh, being aggressive is attractive. Although it is a part, you know, aggression is a part of, uh, you know, a female will like it, but the first thing is kindness and because kindness d directly relates to the, can you take care of the baby, you know? So it kind of gives, you know, you being kind, you being soft will kind of ensure the girl that you'll take care of the baby. Uh, aggression plays a part, uh, but it's, it comes second or third. Uh, as Jordan Peterson said, uh, cont women like men who, men who can control their aggression. So not meaning like getting angry or g having these things, like meaning like someone who can show all their aggression on the guitar and discipline it a girl will really like that because it tells tells her that you know you you can take care of the baby the way you take care of the guitar and yeah so being kind is like the most important thing thanks bro uh thanks raghav how can you make a lot like join in milliseconds do you watch anime or k-pop if then a lot of jokes. I don't know. I, I watch anime. One of my favorite anime is Vinland Saga. It's good. It's cute. Thanks. Fun gaming queen. What is your education? How do you guess people's name and age? So I never guessed people's name. I just told them to pretend uh, like I guessed your name and they'll be like, oh, like that <laughs> age. So age is simple. Uh, basically you want to hear their voice. Uh, and, uh, you can also tell the way that they blink their eyes and everything like, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's more like a, like an instant thing. You know, the more you talk, it's, it's good news. Uh, do you really draw pictures? Well, I do draw pictures. That's the question. And I said the truth. I really draw the pictures. Okay. Finally, I have three questions. Bro, bro gave four questions, but okay. 
how much do you earn now that you have over million subscribers okay guys the truth is that uh i earned in six digits six digits rupees it depends you know sometimes it's high sometimes it's low but six digits my least is in six digits my highest is in six digits that's all i can say do you keep in touch with the cute girls from from this past two months i've been trying and i met okay i said this so many times i'll just show it to you guys but I, yeah i'm starting to keep in touch with these girls and i'm trying to like uh go to their place and you know surprise them with gifts and make some videos stuff like that i noticed you have taken down some of your popular videos why is that damn damn bro <sighs> well uh there were some videos where i uh spanked girls and the girls are like oh i i don't know i didn't like it <laughs> uh it's i was embarrassed i don't know why but the weird thing is that my latest video you know I, I want to help you guys like I don't want to turn you guys you know I don't want to like just turn you on and just make me just watch this video get the views get the money get the view like I don't want to be like that I want to like uh, create some transformation within you guys like help you guys get a girlfriend or feel less lonely or find your whatever your goal is I want to do something and uh, and some of the videos that me hitting with scale and they're making sounds i don't know what transformation that will do except turning you guys on and making you know getting views but i'm still doing it so i don't know you know but eventually i want my goal is to make you guys uh, happy like i said honey bee right eventually you guys will reach your goals and you'll unsubscribe from me it's like you're i've done my part basically this is not so much as a question but a compl complaint damn why do you make us wait so long so this has been a slow year comparing to previous years uh the slow year because again i'm taking inspiration right uh i'm taking inspiration trying to like uh like it, it's, it's not like uh people often think that it's okay how many videos you want to upload in this week how many this it's like what your ultimate goal is in in youtube and uh it, it it you know i slowed it down four months so but once i get the direction and i have this ultimate goal i can speed it up for the next four to five years and then again i'll slow it down and think okay now that i did uh let's say travel vlogs hopefully uh i'm i'm praying after travel vlogs i'll be like okay now what can i do you know can i do something with my friends can i do something with uh, movies can i do something with uh, can i make woke movies uh you know something like that and this slowing down is so important because this is the one that changed the direction and that's what many people in covid slowed down right and then you can see their life started to change they they started to you know edit more they started to play video games more they because in covid times there was no schedule there was no like you have to do this you have to do this it was like do whatever you want and then you did what your heart wants and then some people now are became youtubers because of that because covid slowed it down and not saying covid is a good thing but for some for me especially it was good thing because i completely gave up on youtube i mean sorry completely gave up on football and went on youtube and that was like the turning point and even after covid finished i became uh, uh, a a small club uh, player not so small actually it's pretty big uh, and uh, i exactly i got another injury and then one month before that injury i went viral so everybody like called me and they were started to tease me and you know like i said i have like this you know shyness and now this personality i realized that you know I can't do everything and I start I just play football with the walls in my uh, house so that uh I can get some blood flowing in me you know like get some 
Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'll answer some of the questions. Damn, I've been talking for 20 minutes. I'll answer some of the question uh, from Instagram. I also asked people. Uh, tell us about yourself in Telugu with J Jack Sparrow style or more. <clears throat> Ego Bavo and Jack Sparrow. Dumulaya Pesta. Sorry, guys, my Telugu isn't that good. Okay. Why are you gay? Cute, cute. Who is your crush? Hmm. I don't actually have a crush. Your dream 11 aside team. And a girl asked that. Damn. Okay. Should I, should I do this? Do people really care about football? Okay, I'll tell fast. Fernando Torres, Zlatan Ibrahimovic, Cristiano Ronaldo, Andres Iniesta, Tony Cruz, Kevin De Bruyne, Thiago Silva, Marcelo, Andy Robertson, James Milner, Allison. These are my, hopefully I said it right. Okay. Some I'm answering most. Uh, come on, come on. Why are you so shy when you talk to girls? Because girls really like you when you talk to them. Like I said, you know. <laughs> What's your age? I'm 23 on December 24th. By this time, this you probably watch this. It'll, I'll be 23. Favorite hero over Tollywood law? I, uh, I don't know if Danush is Tollywood, but I like uh, Danush. And I also like uh, Naveen. Naveen Polishetti. He's uh, anyone who takes roles that are not, doesn't show like too much heroism. I like them because they're trying to like, uh, uh, no, no, no more woke stuff. No more woke stuff. I'm a funny guy. Who is my inspi who's my inspiration? Okay. This is a good question. This is my second last question. Because it's 23 minutes. Second last. Who's my inspiration? Okay, there is... So, you know, remember I said I was lonely? Guys, remember I said I was lonely and uh, there was one person I would listen to every single day because I would have some chest pain when I'm going to sleep and uh, I would listen to Joe Rogan. No, out of all the people, I would listen to Joe Rogan and especially his wildlife episodes where he talks about birds, polar bears, uh, stuff like that because I couldn't go to sleep, right? Sometimes. Uh, I would sleep at 9 and wake up at 12. Like, sleep at 9 p.m. Like, my sleep schedule, I wouldn't sleep. So, I would listen to this podcast. And sometimes Joe Rogan, he's like, he talks about political stuff and I would get bored, right? And then I would automatically fall asleep. And uh, till this day, I listen to him, like, for the past three years. And then there is Huberman. So... Huberman is this guy uh, who talks about neuroscience, uh, like waking up at six and sunlight. Because I came from a football background, I'm a little bit slightly disciplined. Uh, actually, I'm a lot of like like lot disciplined because I would get really mad if I messed up my sleep for even ten minutes, not ten minutes, maybe thirty minutes. So Huberman, Rogan. I would say Ronaldo, you know, uh, one of the things Ronaldo said that inspired me a lot is that every little thing matters. Like you coming back home and doing that small stretching when 
when your muscles are tired you're doing small stretching small uh, intakes of water small you know small like small intakes the small small things lead up to big things you know ronaldo said that which inspired me a lot thinking i'm think i'm think i'm forgetting someone but yeah there's someone man no, it's not okay mr beast yeah mr beast yeah mr beast mr beast is mr beast okay last question let's see What is your greatest achievement so far? Last question. My greatest achievement is making my parents proud. Hopefully. I don't feel like I achieved that much guys. You know? It's a good thing and a bad thing also. I feel like I have a lot of potential. In the next 5 years it's going to be huge whatever I'm going to do because 22 to 25 28 is like the prime years and 28 to 32 is like the prime years you holding on and 32 to 38 is like the years you just try to like keep the consistency try to you know ups and downs and 38 to 42 is like the slow years. You know, and each four to five years, I want to do something, something really hard and dive deep into it and like love it, you know, so I, I, I want challenge, you know, I, I want to feel challenged and I want to like uh, wake up and feel stressed about something that I love and uh, having that as an achievement is like amazing, you know, because I wake up and the first thing that I think about is YouTube because stress is good you know and it, the fact that it comes from youtube is like something that i love something football something you know it's like amazing like the reason why you wa want to watch india versus uh australia final because the stress right it's it it's stre like stretches you pushes you like you know you want india to win that's just that's just how much i want to win and that 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 kind of i have it in me you know, and uh, that's like my achievement. And I had it since I was 15, you know, that I told you, right? I, I turned 16 and this happened. This is, oh my God, I went for 28 minutes. So guys, this has been like my own podcast. If anybody wants to invite me to a podcast and ask me how to get a girl, I will uh, actually let me know if you guys want me to make a full video on how to get a girlfriend. I, I know that, trust me guys, how to get a girlfriend from a guy who never had a girlfriend. If you want it, let me know in the comments. If anybody wants to invite me to the podcast, they can. And have a great day, guys. I'm very excited from ex very excited to see where I'll be taking you guys on a journey. But I will give my everything, whatever it is. Bye-bye.